For this construction, we're going to take three lengths that have been given to us and make a triangle out of them. For this, we can actually start with any one of those three sides. Generally, though, the easiest one to deal with first is the longest side. So I would suggest just making a copy of the longest side first. So you have to remember how to construct a copy of a line segment. Make a line obviously bigger than the one we're trying to copy. Open up our compass to be that size. And come down here and make a mark. This is our first length, our first side of our triangle. Now remember that this is the end point here. A lot of students screw up and use this as the end point when they do the next step to this thing, but it's not. This is the point that we want over here, not this one. So keep that straight. Now we're going to attach this little side of the triangle to either the left or the right side. And I can attach the middle side of the triangle either to the left or right side. It's going to be our choice. So for me, I'm going to attach the small side to the left so I'm going to open up my compass to be the size of the small end segment. And I'm going to come over here. And if I attach the small side to this end point, like if it is a thin piece of wood or something, and I attach it to the side of my triangle, I know that the end point is going to end up somewhere along this arc. Similarly, I'm going to take the middle side, or the middle length, of the ones given to me. And I'm going to open up my compass to that length. And I'm going to come down here, remember, to this point, not to this one. I'm going to attach it to this side of my triangle. And it's going to come, it's going to intersect where the other one was. That is the third point to my triangle. And so I can attach this side over here. And I can attach this side over here. This one came over here. And this one was on this side and I've successfully made a triangle out of the three lengths that were given to me.